damn good. irritating. I should have cleaned it first. Well, I didn't get no headshots. I got one right next to the Yeah, head. I see that. Maybe twice in the same spot cup on a couple of them because it looked pretty shredded. It looked like maybe two went through the same spot. Okay. <laughs> but, you know, a person's head is a lot bigger than right. that. Yeah, you'd have took their ear off. It would at least be death. Yeah, it would have stopped them. Definitely a little to the left. Where'd you hit it? Show that. Even these, if that was an actual human, because you know, obviously this is a lot smaller than a human head. Yeah, you're gonna, you're gonna hurt. Then we got the body shots. There's a whole bunch of unspent down there. 
Well, I'm pretty happy with this. All this. Even the arm shot. That, I mean, that's going to slow somebody down while I finish that, I guess. So, this is how I really used to shoot right off the bat. It was like this. I mean, I when I went for my CCW, we had practice round. And I did this. And they were like, you don't have to do the rest because you're basically qualified for with your practice round. <laughs> they didn't they told me I didn't need to waste <clears throat> the ammo. Yeah, but how many hours of practice did we do before oh, you went? Oh, a lot. You know? Yeah, I mean, I, you know, but... Because I, obviously, I had to learn. I mean, it, it pretty much, this is how I always shot. But it's been... I think we talked about it. I think it's been probably... It's been at least five years... And I'm thinking it's been more like eight since I've practiced at all. So it took me a second About to 30 get back rounds. in a... It's kind of, I don't know. I guess anything you don't do for a while, you, it takes you a second. But it does come back and you obviously don't do too bad. I'm going to switch guns. I'm actually going to use the gun that I carry, which is a 380. Yeah, oh yeah. I mean, you hit a couple body shots, but, you know, you only shot, what, six rounds through that thing in how many years, so uh, give it a little it's bit. It's been longer on this one, I think, because it hurts my hand. Ah, uh, because it's so small. But, you know, I keep self-defense Hornaday's in it. That's what I carry. These are just Winchester whatever bomb Me was. full metal jacket the 380 ones, ammo's yeah. never been cheap cheap so i don't shoot it a lot but i tr you know i figured it's good to get a little practice in since i do carry that one it's enough to stop somebody a person's bigger than that target silhouette so liver shot there. I don't know. Well, uh, you didn't hit the black parts. Those are all mine. Okay.
down below your eight shot. Ah, in the seven, yep. off to the left, okay. Good shot. Nice little growing shot there. Is that it? Was that it? Yep, that's okay. it. Yep. Yeah, you did good. Of course, you've been shooting guns a lot longer than yeah, I have. I've been shooting but... guns since I was about seven. Oh, yeah. Yep, that was a good shot right there. But all of yeah, these. Yeah, see, like, uh, this was well, I can't remember which one was one of these was mine yeah I think one or two one of those were mine yours. that's yours that's yours yeah and of course the bullseye mm-hmm right. I think I'm gonna load back up and I'm gonna try some head shots okay I'm not sure. That one I think went off to the side that way, but <clears throat> oh, you might have got a neck shot. Huh? You, I think you got a neck shot. Oh, yep. Yeah. Okay. See that one? Right in the mouth. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. You didn't get your head shot, but you got some good shots. I made a smile. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like I hit her. There's a double one there. I don't know. Well, between the two of us. Yeah, they're not going to make it. Not too shabby. That was fun. I had a good time shooting. Uh, we do realize that we have an issue with our, with that 9mm. It's really kind of mine, but we have kind of have an issue with that 9mm not ejecting properly, but we probably should have cleaned the gun. We, I guess I should maintain them a little more often, a little better, because it, yeah, it, I think it just needs a little cleaning. So when, you know, we get home, that's that's probably one of the tasks that we'll do, probably get those guns clean. Uh, right now, we're having some issues with the generator. So Jesse ran to Dollar General. He's going to grab some uh, Berryman B12 and some of you mechanics may know what that is, you know. Uh, hopefully that'll kind of clean it up. It seems like every time it, it the last couple times we've had to use it when it rained, and last night it started raining and wasn't very long and it started spitting and sputtering and acting crazy. So he ran to town, which was about eight miles away to get that. I am gonna fix up, fix up some food. He's got the generator on. It's about half choked, so it's running, you know, 
pretty high right now if you can hear it. Uh, I'm gonna whip up some of these hash browns and some pancakes. It's still mid-morning and we're hungry and by the time he gets back hopefully I'll have some lunch ready. I'm not gonna bore you with watch and fix all that because you've seen me fix pancakes and hash browns before. But I do have this gadget, this nifty little pancake dispenser thingy that I picked up off of Timu. Woohoo! So I'm going to use that. I think that'll be kind of cool. I can mix it right inside there and everything. So, okay. I don't know what else we'll do today. I've been dreaming on in my head like I've seen it. A life worth living is a life with meaning. I'll do what I love till my heart stops beating. I'm feeding this demon. Got a taste, can't erase bitterness in my face. Work a job every day till your dreams fade away. Like a card, never change. Play the game that we say. I need a break. Don't stand strong, need to move on to be what I want. I'll keep dreaming on. Don't stay strong, need to move on to be what I want. I'll keep dreaming on. Well, that weather changed pretty quickly. It got really cold. It's raining. So we have been stuffed in the camper for the last three, four hours now. Watching Supernatural. Jesse did get back with some of that Berryman B12 stuff. Got it in the generator. Generator's been running perfect. So hopefully that fixed that actually have the generator on right now and I'm going to cook up some dinner. Okay, I am going to put some water in my pan. I made some homemade from scratch egg noodles using my mother's recipe. Froze them, brought them with us. They've been in the refrigerator. I'm going to cook those up. six cups of water here. I think that should be enough. If I have to add more, I will. Got chicken base. And I'm going to bring that to a boil. I have a can of chunk chicken breast that I'm just going to throw in there. Juice and all. Ooh, messy, messy. got to boil about 10-15 minutes or so and then we should be ready to eat. And if you're curious what Jesse's doing while I'm cooking and same goes for her just sitting and waiting. How's it taste? Good. Like them? Yep, very, very good. Cool. Stay strong, need to move on to be what I want. I'll keep dreaming.